I've been so focused on doing these intros that I forgot to mention that we've been doing Record Rundown for a whole year now. It was two weeks ago, but yeah. This will be for the week of April 24th, 2018. I was going to do something for the one year anniversary, but then I didn't. So yeah. <laughs> We've actually been getting a decent amount of actual classical albums, so I'm not too upset about this. Don't mean a thing if it ain't got that swing. I'm thinking about you. From New York, LA. Japan, UK. I'm thinking about you. Again, very much more in the line of R&B and funk, but Robert Glasper and Kate Trinata are great musicians, and there's a couple of funny moments, especially in the outro and intro. <laughs> If you ever wanted a jazz musical interpretation of the musical Man of La Mancha, here you go. And it's funny, because this is a Brazilian jazz artist covering an American musical made about a Spanish book. I honestly get surprised when the more experimental jazz albums are the best selling. But I mean, Nels Klein's a good guitarist, so you know. Singing. If you hated Hardwire, you'll probably like this one better, considering it's more of their older stuff made back in the late 80s. Also, this is a remastered of an EP that has the word re-revisited in it, so that just makes it seem very redundant, in my opinion. Summer's in, came faster than we wanted, come on home. A much lighter album than we typically look at on this show, especially due to the very hard and old folk style of it. Typically, it's just been Benjamin Brunley doing a lot of the writing for the tracks, but after their success of Never Again, this time the entire group contributed. Well, I guess nobody wanted to compete with Cardi B, so yeah. You are my best friend and we've got some shit to shoot. That's the way it is. That's the way it goes. It's just a two. If you like the music from the iPhone 10 commercial released last year in September, well, this is the duo that did it, and this is the album that it's from. And now I need some help for the life, so please! Summer's in. Came faster than we wanted. Come on home. Come on. This not only charted in rock, but it also charted in indie, folk, and country, so that's probably why it's in the top five. Really? People are still buying this? Fans wanted a heavier album, so they got a heavier album. I don't want to choose, and I'm quick. Cut a nigga off, so don't get comfortable. Look. I don't dance now, I make money moves. I always like it when albums like this stay on the charts, because it means I can promote my other videos. It ain't nothing but a review town. Broken hearts and rusted plows. Root trip right. Considering this is his fourth consecutive number one release, he's now joined the likes of Rascal Flatts, being the only country artists to ever do so. And there you go. And like I said, we've been doing this for over a year, so maybe go check out one of the older episodes. Maybe there'll be an album there that you missed. And now I need some help, I don't want to go, please. Please, please.